Tonight's top story, a case of stolen identity ends with a man in handcuffs. Police say this San Antonio man was living for free. He's accused of opening more than 60 fraudulent accounts under someone else's name. According to investigators, the suspect bought a luxury car and even moved into an apartment under the victim's name. Ken's Five reporter Hannah Tita is live at police headquarters. And Hannah, how did this happen? Well, UC's in Henry San Antonio police say it all started in the mail. A 65 year old man's personal information somehow ended up in the wrong hands and police say the suspect ran with that information and started a whole new life for himself. In handcuffs, answering to charges in his own name, police say William Holiday has been living a lie at the expense of a 65 year old victim. His mail was somehow forwarded to this suspect's previous address. Investigators say the mail contained personal information. Holiday is accused of opening 66 fraudulent accounts under the victim's name. The debt collectors were calling him night and day. You know, say, hey, you, you're delinquent on this account, you're delinquent on this account. Confused, the Guadalupe County resident called local authorities, who forwarded the case to SAPD's Financial Crimes Unit. Our detectives go to an apartment complex here in San Antonio. They contact the apartment managers and they give them, hey, I'm here to see the suspect's name. I, I want to talk to him. The managers reportedly told police no one by the suspect's name lived at the apartment. But in that apartment, we do have this person's name. It's the victim's name. Investigators also learned the suspect had recently been pulled over. Our detectives get that body cam footage and they see that our suspect's driving a vehicle. It's a 2021 white Mercedes Benz. That plate comes back in the victim's name. So police went to the dealership where the vehicle was purchased. On that driver's license is the suspect's picture with the victim's name. Holiday now faces several felony charges. It just shows the hard work that our detectives do on a daily basis. And police say this case really highlights the importance of protecting your personal information. So make sure that your mail is going to the right address. Never leave your wallet in a vehicle and always make sure to shred documents with personal information as well as mail. Reporting live downtown tonight, Hannah Tita, Ken's Five. Thank you, Hannah.